I'm so bored of all these Among Us inspired games and knockoffs. I wish that somebody would build another game I liked inside of Roblox. Hey, Kaden, I have an idea for you then. What's that? If you want a game that you like inside of Roblox, why not play Roblox inside of Roblox? Roblox inside of Roblox? <sighs> My head hurts. That's because you're too stupid to process that. Oh, I am pretty stupid. I'll just show it to you, dum-dum. Okay, thanks, Consciousness. See? This here, it's called Retro Studio, and it's a game that recreates Roblox inside of Roblox. But not only that, you can also create your own games inside of Roblox and customize a retro Roblox character with items that you can purchase in a replicated Roblox catalog. Well, that game sounds awesome. Thanks, Consciousness, Kaden. Now let's get in there, my fumble family, and experience Roblox inside of Roblox. In other words, Robloxception. Ah. Okay, here we are inside of Retro Studio, which is from the same studio. Studio Retro Dev that made Retro Blocks, the game I played in the past that had a bunch of Retro Roblox games. So as you know, they are a pretty fantastic studio, and I am very much happy to be testing out their new game. So in this game, you can not only play games that players made with an old studio engine, but you can make your own games in that studio engine. On top of that, you can customize your avatar, which I've done by coloring myself as a little like Sleepy Sandman looking dude. You can also use items that you can purchase through the catalog with something called Retrobux, which is very similar to Robux, but retro. Nice. So we're gonna purchase some Retrobux right now so we can look super cool. I don't want to play a game unless I can look super cool. So now we have 120... 12,000 Robux. I could read Retrobux. We have 12,000 Retrobux. And we're gonna use it to buy some items. Oh! I think we need to buy that. I will purchase the troll face, though I regret it already. Okay, purchase was successful. Dear God, why have I done this? Hmm. The chicken suit would be a nice thing to pair with the troll face. I, I think, I mean, if I saw a chicken with a human looking troll face like this, I would probably kiss that chicken on the beak. Okay, and last but not least, we'll buy some 3D glasses so we can make it really hard for ourselves to see in normal situations. Now let's customize. Where, where, where? Bam! Okay, you can't see the glasses, but whatever. We look really good other than that. Zach, if you could please zoom in on that and play some heavenly music. Oh, it disappeared. Uh, if you could please zoom in on the blank square that my avatar used to be in and play some heavenly music. Wow, he looks great, doesn't he? Enough of the customization. Now it's time to start building. And then we're gonna play some other people's games. So I hit create place here and now khaki shorts, no worries, place number one is existent. And as you can tell, I am on my alt, khaki shorts, no worries. So this video is in fact filled with no worries. Now before we get to editing our very own game, I do want to ask you a quick favor, my fumble family. If you are not already, I would very much appreciate it if you subscribed and liked this video because that does help me out a whole butt ton and scientifically speaking a whole butt ton is a whole ton Butts. so that would be greatly appreciated if you don't want to do that that's fine i'll find you and spit on you now back to building okay i pressed edit and now we're being teleported to studio oh my goodness this is so cool this looks exactly like how roblox studio did back in the day uh, i don't know exactly when back in the day is but it was a while ago Okay, so, uh, oh my god, I don't even remember how to use this. I imagine I'm, I'm lagging. I mean, the game is in beta or, or, like, something like that, alpha or something like that. So, features may not be completely added yet, but, uh, it seems pretty interesting. Uh, here's my base plate right here. I just inserted battle armor on accident. Let's, we'll get rid of that. We don't need that right now. We can use all these models here to build something, because search doesn't appear to be working at the moment. But that's no big deal. All the tools up here appear to work. This is so advanced. Oh my god how did you recreate roblox studio in roblox no matter we're gonna make a game called taxis that eat people the premise of the game is taxis and people and people that get eaten by taxis so long story short you don't want to be this girl right here but you do want to be this taxi right here who gets a nice snack oh oh no i lagged for a second and i just kept clicking things and now now we got a lot of things so um as you can see lag uh and clicking too much with while being impatient has kind of destroyed my game so let's test it out before it gets any worse than it already is
Oh no. I pressed play and my building fell apart. I don't get it. Isn't the floor of the house supposed to go above the roof? Isn't that how it works? Why is this happening? Okay, I've updated place and now I'm leaving the studio. Are you sure you want to leave? You could lose all unsafe data. Doesn't matter to me, silly flumpus. I saved my data. Okay, my football family. As you can hear by the intense action music playing, we are about to try out my awesome new game. So let's get in there and experience greatness. Play! I, I said play! Teleporting to game. Okay, my fumble family, here it is. The game that we made together as a fumble family. I am quite proud of this and the six rocket launchers that it comes with. Not to mention our avatar looks phenomenal, if I do say so myself. Now let's try it out. The point of the game was to consume people with taxis, I believe. And let's see if it works. Let's see. Guest 1337. That's our target. Oh god, he's so hard to hit. It's really hard to control, honestly. Uh, the taxi spins out of control, but uh, I, I think I have a solution. Rocket launcher. Oh my god, it hurt me. Uh, I don't think I'm very good at games, but we'll we'll finish the job since we've already dealt some damage. Oh, oh no, oh no. What have I done? <laughs> Take that. Oh, I also died in the process. My game is terrible. Now let's play some actual good games by actually good builders and people like that. Okay, and now we are going to be trying some other people's games. So they have a whole bunch of different categories you can choose from. Featured, popular, most visited, recently played, and favorites. We currently have no favorites and we've only played my own game, which I don't want to ever revisit again. <laughs> so let's play one of these, shall we? There's Evil House in Robloxia, which happens to have a wonderful winning smile which is terrifying and i regret this but you know what i i think i'm gonna play it and i'm gonna favorite it so i can come back to it where is happy house the description says why does that concern me kaden ah yes smaller me where is happy house uh, i don't i don't know go away where is happy house kaden uh. Let's get in there and find out where Happy House is. Okay, we're loading in, and as you can see, the screen does replicate the old Roblox loading screens, which is so cool. It fills me with nostalgia. It makes me feel like I'm two again. I was not two when I played Roblox. Disclaimer, I don't... The word, the number two just came out. I don't know what happened. Okay, here we are. Oh, wow. There is some lag going on, but honestly, it's probably my fault. Uh, in, in fact, I'm 100% certain it's my fault. I would kind of my internet is garbage right now. That being said, we're kind of just in lag land, but this is still really cool. <laughs> uh, even the chat looks like the old Roblox chat. Uh, people are just teleporting around right now. Once again, just my computer. But um, I think it's pretty cool. Apparently, there's an admin in the server. Yeah, look. Uh, mint. Mint bit. Whoever that is, you're important. I don't know if they're an admin for like Roblox or an admin in this game specifically, but that's pretty cool. It seems that you can get murdered by zombies and uh, we'd love that. We love getting murdered by zombies on the Kate and Phone Bottom YouTube channel, especially when they have cute koala hats. Aww. Other than that, it seems like you just hang out in a house. So that's pretty cool. Now this game is cool at all, but let's check out another one that maybe has a little less lag and more playability. Not to be confused with the laugh ability, who was a very nice YouTuber. If you look here, it says somebody made Tower of Hell. Uh, that sounds pretty interesting. I would love to see a custom-made retro version of Tower of Hell made inside of Roblox, inside of a Roblox game. That sentence confused me as much as it confused you. Now let's try that out. The description says, this is a recreate. Oh, I just clicked on another one. The description says, this is a recreation of Tower of Hell. Every week there is A, and then it gets cut off. So, I don't know. Expect A every week. Here goes. Caden versus the Tower of Hell. Can he do it? No, you can't do it, stinky smelly noob. You're probably right. Oh my god, that, it pulls up a Roblox menu that's even the old Roblox menu. That's so cool. Okay, so here we are in the Roblox Tower of Hell. Uh, as you can see, I am still laggy as my avatar is not very much moving. Ah, uh, there we go. Now he's starting up. Sometimes this old engine just needs a minute to start up. Okay, and now we are going to walk through the Tower of Hell or, or jump through it. I, I don't know what's up with all the satanic floating guests that uh, have summoned themselves from the depths of hell and now float in the sky yelling a lot of different things, such as update board, no updates found, team glitch was fixed, and no updates found, no updates found, and no updates found. So as you can see, these guests have a lot to say. Apparently, the owner couldn't even complete his own obby, but that's just the smack that this guest over here is talking. Now let's smack this guest for talking smack. 
Ugh. And let's start climbing. Here goes nothing, or should I say, literally everything, even though that's not true. All right, let's go. I'm so laggy that my character's arms like stay in the air like I'm screaming and running from something. <laughs> so far, so good. I I'm doing pretty decent. This is pretty awesome for having been made inside of a Roblox game. All right, you gotta jump over the, the red poops. You don't wanna touch the bloody poop. That's gross. Your character will die of grossness. No, oh no! It's not, it's not even the lag, it's just me being terrible at everything I do. I will beat this obby, unlike the owner of this game, who could not beat their own obby, says the guest. Oh no, somebody else has joined, and their name is Jiv something, and they want to race me. I'm not going to let that happen. Chicken Man is the greatest obby doer in all of Roblox. Oh, what happened? <laughs> I must have touched a brick without realizing because I just, I died and, and my lag has solidified me in, in the middle of space and time. I can't fall apparently. Oh my god, look, it's the old force fields I used to get in Roblox. This is bringing back so many memories for me. Uh, if my Fumble family, if you are interested in this game, certainly check it out. It is in the description below and it is totally worth the playing because it is exactly what Roblox was like back in the day in like 2010, 2009, 2011 area around there or so. So if you want to experience that, you definitely can. Okay, now we're jumping over brown orange poops, meaning they either drink a lot of orange juice or munch on a lot of carrots. I don't care either way, I don't want to touch that poop. Ugh. Poop avoidal jumps activate! Da -da 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 -da. I'm the best poop misser in all the Wild West, and that's a fact. Chickens might be somewhat flightless birds, but this chicken seems to be flying. Oh god! Right to the bottom. <laughs> I spoke too soon. You know what they say, 7812 times the charm. Man, Vic is passing me up so much. How does it feel to be on top of the world, buddy? I wouldn't know. I'm just a lowly troll chicken who falls easily. <laughs> but not today. Today I shall conquer. And, and, oh no, I definitely touched the lava brick. I'm dead. I might as well just sit here and die. Like so. Okay, I think this is where I was at the, at the last point where I got the highest. So here I am again at the highest point I've been to. Jumping over poop. This one's intense. That's quite the large turd. That one probably caused constipation. But as you can see, Javik made it to winners. So if Javik can make it to winners, so will I. Hucha! Come on, Chicken Caden. Believe in yourself! Yeah! Believe it! It's working! Yes, all you have to do to win is say Naruto quotes and you'll surely do great. These are tricky bricks! These ones are little troll bricks, just like the face I'm wearing. They are made to make you fall, but I won't fall for that because I myself am a chicken troll and I can see through your ways. This one's just a walk. I don't really, it's not really a challenge, just kind of walking. But I'll give you credit, it's it's something. Now that I've walked the walk, it's time to see if I can get to the top. We're almost there. Oh, no, we're not. Let's keep going then. Yep, that's totally how people look when they climb. Good job, old Roblox. You got that down. Why did they ever replace that animation? Bounce, bounce, bounce. Whoa, that's a pile of turds. We don't want to touch that. Get away from me, stinky turds. Ah, why am I so scared right now? I'm struggling, man. I'm worried. You might even say, I'm chicken. Get it? Because... I'm in a chicken suit. Woo! Okay. Yes, all is well. I, I I started walking up the ladder without my hands for a second there, too. I'm getting a little too confident, it seems. Oh, man, these ones always get me. Not today, though! Bam! Oh, I just hit my head on that. Oh, I'm gonna have a concussion after this. Okay, uh, here we are against a green wall. Zach, if you could please insert something behind me. Oh, wow. Easy, now, right? this is quite Start an interesting feature to add to this game. I, I very much like this. Thank you, Zach, for whatever you added. Uh, this is actually really complicated. I, I think I can have the ground my head, like how to do this, but like at the same time, not really. So, oh god, no! Well, at least we fell on the little walkie part. Get back up there! Javik did it so easily, and they're probably a noob, like an actual noob. I I've been playing since Roblox looked like this. No, no! <laughs> I fell so far! Ah, forget this, man. I give up. I am the worst obby player of all time. And now I'm gonna go cry in a corner, alone and sad. So now I will reset my character using the old menu and leave. Ugh. Take 
that game. Okay, I decided to test out one last game. This one's called Escape the Volcano Abbey. Uh, it had some vintage feel to it, so I wanted to see it real fast. Here, you can talk to a volcano, which tells you if you're at the pink stage, reset and find an alternative solution. Thanks, volcano. Over here, you can see an erupting volcano picture, which indicates that you can go over here to jump into an erupting volcano. Over here is a dude frozen saying no problem, which is very 2010 Roblox. Now let's try this thing out for ourselves, shall we? Bam. Lava jumps. I can do these in my sleep. In fact, totally not looking right now. <sighs> yeah, I did that in my sleep. More lava jumps and an epic face. This really is retro. It even changes the color of your torso like old Roblox spawns used to do. Every time you touch a team spawn, it used to change the color of your torso. So you could never wear your favorite colored shirt unless it was your favorite colored team as well. Uh, over here, there is a, a little reference called the Epic Duck, which was like a Roblox 2009 to 2012 thing. That was a big meme on the internet at one point. Uh, I don't really know why, but I miss it. I miss the little duck. I mean, really big duck. Oh, hey, it's the jump on the turd level. I love that. Back in, you know, the day, we always jumped on turds. That was, oh, I died from jumping on the turds. Look at that octopus. He's so disappointed in me for dying. He's like, really, Caden? You jumped on the turds and died? Well, guess what, octopus? I'm gonna jump on you next. Take this. Oh no, I've made a terrible mistake. I've jumped into the octopus and they consumed me. My fumble family, I'm leaving. After that failure, I just don't think I can keep going on, my fumble family. So all in all, I think Retro Studio is a fantastic new game. I highly suggest you check it out and support the creators by playing it down in the description below. <coughs> And let me know what you thought of the video by liking the video or commenting down below as well. Until next time, my fumble family, thank you so much for watching. And retro Roblox player, slap. Is that too hard? Take one of these instead.